Welcome, everybody. Uh, we're back with our last segment of the night. Um, and this segment is based on the idea of the New Yorker uh, cartoon captions. So um, this is probably going to be our most disorganized. Um, <laughs> but the general idea here is that I've collected a few images that I thought were easy to set up to tell a story. And uh, the idea is going to be that I'm going to show the image and the four of us are going to try to come up with our best captions. You feel free to throw out whatever. Um, and if we like it better than our own ideas, we might just take it. But um, once no, we no, all... No, no, no. Go ahead. We're not going to take it. We're going to... Uh, internalize all of the data given to us <laughs> by the audience and generate our own answer that is extremely not theirs. Promise. Exactly. That's yeah, very different. It's gonna be. It's gonna be something totally original, <laughs> even if based on pre-existing things. I'm um, training my model. So there's gonna be a little bit of downtime in this. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show the image and we're gonna take a moment to write our own captions. Feel free to pitch whatever. Um, and once I've gotten captions from everyone, uh, you all can just post them in our little Discord chat. Um, I'm just going to put them on screen with no name on them, but I'll put numbers next to them. And I'll put up a poll for you to vote on which ones you like. I mean, obviously, if yeah. one of us takes your caption, feel free to vote for it. Um, but once we've done that, um, we will have that image and that caption featured prominently on the page of the Neo Yorker. Um... It's not new. It's Neo. It's different. It's better. Chat loves some democracy. I see you oh, down yeah. there. <laughs> so this is a little caption contest we're doing. Um, it's just silly fun. And like I said, this is going to be probably our most disorganized segment. Um, yeah. But here is our first image right here. Hmm. Hmm. Whoever types the one thing first gets it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Red, you already took kind of half what I was doing. Oh, damn it. I, I guess I'll commit. I'll commit to it. Screw it. Oh, these are, these are, it's pretty strong. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Alright, we have our captions. Let me put them on, uh, on the layout really quickly. Um. And then I'll put up a poll to match it. That's a chuckle funny, yes. <laughs> do you want me to do the bowl? How long do you want it? Uh, let's do two minutes. Got it. Um, and you can just have four options, one, two, three, four, because that's how I'm going to display it on screen. I've lost all my... I'm balancing so many windows. <laughs> You are wearing so many hats, and I cannot assist you in any meaningful capacity. So, you know, good luck. <laughs> Should have given his avatar a few more hats. <laughs> uh, no, I'm not. I'm no, not going to draw no. hat silhouettes. I'm not going to draw hat silhouettes. Nope. I'm not going to draw hat silhouettes and say, good. Hey, Author Blues, I know that you're wearing very many hats right now, but would you How like to position hats? a whole bunch of hats on top of your own right, avatar? Here are your potential captions. They're all pretty good. The poll there's, is out. There's not a bad choice here. <laughs> 
<laughs> I do like how it's solemnly no bitches. <laughs> no bitches. No bitches. No bitches. First no law: bitches. no bitches. <laughs> No. Bitches. Bitches. No bitches. Really? No bitches. <laughs> on a Saturday night? <laughs> By the way, while we have a moment of downtime while you vote, make sure you get your votes in. Uh, this layout was a very much a, cumul uh, a, a group effort. Um, this was the last one, no, second to last one to get put together, and all of the text that's in the background here is uh, Open GP2 or the GP2 GPT2 uh, AI generator with the prompt with the rising interest in algorithms. Uh, should traditional artists be worried? And it, boy, it sure told a story. Uh, didn't Sanguinary find that as well? No, I, I generated a different one, but uh, it was... Through the same uh, generator, yeah. Yeah. And then I did another prompt where uh, Wobbly went to a f robot factory and started a fist fight, and it, it had a okay time with that one. <laughs> All right, it looks like uh, Wobbly barely... Uh, beat it oh, out. Oh, wow. I did not uh, anticipate that, actually. Wow. And no, so I don't with that... The poll. He barely beat out mine, which was no bitches. We have our... <laughs> we have our, our Neo Yorker cartoon for this page. Excellent. It's beautiful. <laughs> I, f I feel like it's less of a, a cartoon caption and more of a, a journalistic story at this point. <laughs> yeah, yeah. First peak. Why robot? Why, Why robot? Why robot? <laughs> Why? Why robot? Why? Why robot? All right, so our next image. Let's uh, head back. Domo arigato, porque robato. Domo. Porque robato. <laughs> porque. I'm trying a little- I, I don't know that I might be disturbing my housemates, but I'm terrified that I am, so I'm attempting to contain my- my bodacious motions. I just, I'm, the chat has taken a, a very specific approach to this caption contest that's making me lose it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I have to just steal this one. This one's better than what anything I've come up with in my head so far. I've, I've got, <laughs> sorry. It's just, it's, it's tickling me in a very specific way. I have to steal this. Oh no. I've stared at this image now too long, and I have not come up with anything that's made me laugh harder than that. <laughs> I can't wait to see which one it is. Alright, let me set up the... Not not reading these out loud is is difficult. I God, know. they're all so good. Yeah, the the ones in chat, a lot of them are super good. Yeah. <laughs> I liked how many people suggested just man. <laughs> man. 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 Damn. Man. <laughs> Counter. Parentheses guilty gear voice. <laughs> all right. Destroy! <laughs> did you set up the poll for this one? Oh yeah. I just started it. <laughs> I'm terrified to watch the votes roll in, but I'm gonna do it anyway! <laughs> Every 
time I read it, it made me laugh harder. Man. <sighs> Man. You know, they like to pretend that making Jaxbox games is hard, but, you know, here we are. <laughs> Give us one AI generator and we'll we got, make five. We've got Jackbox games at home. <laughs> the Jackbox games at home. <laughs> Look, there's a, some assembly required, but if we all pitch together... <laughs> I had, like, an idea I was trying to turn into a caption in my head, and I completely <laughs> lost the thread when I read, When your mom do not make the spaghetti. <laughs> and it's it's like, spaghetti. like, I can't... I can't write oh. the thing that's in my- I was trying to come up with, like, something about I can't believe they left me on this planet. And, like, I was trying to figure out how do you make that funny? <laughs> and then my brain just became... <laughs> Oth's brain. When it's on the spaghetti. 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 I just went for the easy, low-hanging, bogo's vented joke, which I'm sure you guys are familiar with. I'm Bogo's not surprised bented. to see chat rallying around the hometown hero. Here, here is the Bogo's bent in <laughs> chat. <laughs> Bogo's bent in? What? Bogo's bent. <laughs> Alright, well, it would be inappropriate for me to take the credit for this one since this was directly from the chat. Um,. But there is your winner. When your mom do not make the spaghetti. You know, it, it looks more stately and beautiful when, when placed in this format. Oh. <laughs> oh I think about body. Bogus Minted all the time. Bogus Minted? Bogus Minted. You go to bed and you're like, man, those Bogos, do they ever get Minted? You gotta know on clearing out the old <laughs> captions before I reveal the next picture. My bogos, they've been binted. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Here is your next image. Man. Oh, there Man. we go. <laughs> <laughs> mm. <laughs> See if I can think of anything good for this. I don't know if Usha sitting here cackling at these is making it better or worse, but I'm, I'm losing it. I'm losing my mind. <laughs> you know, it's the it's it's around hour four and a half. No, we've we've lost the plot. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Amber. I'll, I'll attempt to uh, divert my gaze, but there's not a part of my screen where funny text isn't just showing up. <laughs> you can't look in any direction around here without seeing comedy. <laughs> It's everywhere! Somebody right, coming out your eyeballs! Captions are up. Pulls up. There's, there's so many silly darlings just everywhere. Jeff's <laughs> 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 is good. Jeff's <laughs> is good. <laughs> Throw, really good. Yeah. Throw mine out. Replace it with that. <laughs> <laughs> is, is it too late to change my submission? Nope. <laughs> it's never too late. Well, okay. Maybe now is too late. 
Oh, oh nuts. <laughs> Dang, darn, beans. <laughs> I really goofed it this time. <laughs> oh, that's so good, Jeff. <sighs> oh. I think I'm getting into a giggle cycle with y'all. <laughs> the infectious giggles. <laughs> yeah, like I'll like I'll just be dying down, and I'll hear somebody like blow the air out of their nose, and I'm just off again. It's gone. It's the slap happy hours. Yeah. <laughs> We're getting to the hours. point where like we have so much built up laughter that just everything is making us laugh now. Yeah. <laughs> it, you took the you, you uncapped the hose fully. God, White Panther, that's good too. Oh, I didn't now I want to vote on y'all's captions. Yeah, what what the hell are we doing? White Panther said, top ten list, what for? <laughs> <laughs> so good. The sex oh. tape did not help my career. <laughs> Yarn does not work the same way. <laughs> Those, um, so, uh, we're using a tool from, uh, Fugitech to do the voice indicators, and Wobbly drew all the images for them. Yeah. Crushed it, honestly. Which he shouldn't have done, because his yeah, wrist we, is injured. I'm reminded sorry, him sorry. several times not to, but... You know. This, this is one of the nice things about living in the sunny paradise of Albuquerque, when all of y'all don't live there, nobody can stop me. I'll destroy no, my body if I want to. <laughs> I'm gonna drive to Albuquerque just to put Wobbly in a headlock and then give him a swirly. Uh, I'm gonna be honest, I think the yard there, so. started around the divorce. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. I thought it wasn't gonna go very well because it's like it's kind of like a newspaper comic joke, but at the same time, like this it's is, all I could think of. This about. is the New Yorker. That's yeah. I I when That's I first true. envisioned this, it is a this, literal newspaper. Yeah, when I first thought about this, I was thinking like, oh, I'm pretty good at generating like jokes in a theme, like like words in a theme, and then I was like. I don't think writing a literal, like, New Yorker caption would be very funny. And now I'm realizing that it's even funnier when you write them in the style of the New Yorker. <laughs> and the italics is doing the good work, too. Just Yeah, the italics does really emphasize it. <laughs> oh my god. This, this whole layout is just, just chef kiss. Oh yeah. It's the one, it's the, it's the segment that was least organized, but the layout that was perhaps most put together, I mean, on my part, because I made it, but, but like. Yeah. It's, I, it's amazing how, like, the production values have, have escalated since the gallery as well. Yeah. Was, like, beautiful. Yeah. We had, we had, like, who's your Pokemon, or, or like. Who's that Pokemon, which is the one where I was still trying not to hurt my wrist, and I wasn't like, oh yeah, let me just 3D generate a stage. <laughs> like, I'm gonna yeah, try well, not to put do together that. that stage in like an hour. Yeah. Not even that. At the very yeah. start of the segment. It was very quick. <laughs> Alright, here's your next one. Christ. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. <laughs> these is super good <laughs> oh and chat just like what the fuck just steal it it's yeah, yours now nope you... nope nope i'm i'm gonna stick with the one i have but i did highlight uh the one that was that was completely delightful
God, I, I want to make like one joke, but it's only funny to me. It's a little verbose. A little space there. <laughs> I like that one. It's very, it's, it's simple but effective. I'm trying. I'm trying to figure out if I can channel the New Yorker. Oh my god! <laughs> Someone had a really good one in chat. You won't believe how many of us fit in this suit. <laughs> the one I really liked was from Darkman Four Twenty Five. Ground control to Major Ma or Major Pagliacci. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Also, ground control to Major Honk. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna commit to mine, despite how good those are. <laughs> also, uh, since since we're coming into like the the formatting a bit of the the thing, I see a lot of people that are threatening to like come to to Albuquerque and and you know in varying degrees of kindness kick my oh, you're ass. Trying to, you're trying to pitch Wobblecon? Uh, a little yeah. bit. Like, I don't I don't want to have, like, a convention with, like, badges and everything, but, like, Albuquerque is a very inexpensive city to live in, and it is also, again, like, one of the most southern, like, sunny paradises, and I've been thinking about picking a really shitty month, like, January, and just seeing how many people we can get into, like, a round one, or, like, Renaticon yeah, or something. Oh, right, yes, fuck. Sorry, I was... You're fine, I was just, about... I was curious. <laughs> what, what I'm trying to say is that, like, kicking my ass, more likely than you think. <laughs> I would like to kick your ass, but I am worried about the coronavirus. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't read that first prompt yet. I just copied and pasted it in. That's pretty choice. Uh, just to answer Blue Jello's question, uh, for Wobbly, yes, there will be a ball pit, and uh, yes, we will put a Jesus in it. <laughs> <laughs> Butt plug not included. <laughs> the requisite Jesus. And the, the requisite, like, depressed cosplayer. I just read the second one, too! <laughs> <laughs> I'm only just now reading these. <laughs> They're all good. They're all really good. Author Blues learns to read. <laughs> I'm sorry, I had to sound it out. <laughs> it does require reading the name Elon Musk, because I can see why your brain would slide yeah. off of it. <laughs> so Elon Musk, Elon Musk said, I've seen enough. <laughs> <laughs> Teflon for interest. Can you can you make a balloon animals in a vacuum? <laughs> We're finally getting to the science that I require. In space, nobody can hear you honk honk slide whistle. <laughs> <laughs> That's, you know, I was aiming for a Space Station 13 reference, but I think that knocks it out of the park. <laughs> oh my god. This is so much fun. It Just is. It's chill really goofing. Fun. It's very funny. <laughs> this is the one where we could really like reuse the format really easily, especially if we all uh, pitched in prompts. Yeah, and on top of that, like the images that I grabbed, I intentionally picked kind of boring ones. You kind of have yeah. to. So there's I, like no work involved. Speaking of lessening the work, there's 200 uh, equally funny people that if we set up a Google form for, all we would have to do is organize data. Oh yeah, we That's could just true. have people submit stuff for the caption contest. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright, our next image. <laughs> no. Oh, let's see, let's see. Uh... That's Columbo, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> I mean, for a I given believe, value I believe of the exact 
text on the prompt was Columbo and Picard arguing on the deck of the Starship Enterprise. I gotta, I gotta verse myself really quickly on Columbo. I've never watched Actually, no, he's, I watched one episode at MAGFest. He's a detective, and he says, and one more thing. I see we've both gone yeah, to the we, same well. <laughs> I mean, when it comes to Columbo, if you want to write a Columbo line, there's like three topics. Yeah. <laughs> Computer execute program Columbo. <laughs> chats, chats getting in on the Every, every, uh, I'll, we'll have a party here at the well called My Wife. <laughs> Columbo voice, My Everyone's Wife. There. <laughs> oh, Wobbly, we do need to uh, make you watch this at some point. It's the only copaganda that's good. <laughs> hey, I like Law and Order. Boom, boom. <laughs> doink, doink. <laughs> doink, doink. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the, you're not only... too far off, Wobble. You're just too direct. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm like, giving it away. <laughs> no, it's good. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, had, I had to Google some things. <laughs> <laughs> I'll ever think about how much damage Paw Patrol has done. <laughs> oh, God. I can't wait for the post capitalist critique of Paw Patrol. Oh, God. This... All right, pulls up. Funny thing is, your phaser was clearly not set to stun, Captain. <laughs> One more thing. <laughs> Propaganda. Jesus. <laughs> you get uh, one of those uh, phases and... Uh... <laughs> that man ain't phased, he's dead. So you say you just want a Kobayashi Maru, and a funny thing, those are unhinnable. <laughs> yeah, oh uh, this God. weekend I hung out with a bunch of Klingons and uh, got to know them, real good people. <laughs> I feel like there's so much good dialogue you could write if there were ever a Star Trek Columbo crossover, but that would be the most unhinged crossover of all time. I mean, I, they, they had fucking Sherlock Holmes, okay? What does it matter now? <laughs> Columbo brings down Q. <sighs> Q-Lumbo. I was trying Q to... Lumbo. I was trying not to say, like, who did what, like, to not bias people, but I will no, say I mine has got an only one vote, and it's like... Was it yours? I, did you vote for it? No, I, I voted for Sanguinaries. Um, oh, thank you. <laughs> I just, it looked like Columbo was upset, and Picard was just kind of like standing over him, like, "Hey man, you look like a sad boy, you know." Yeah, yeah, he looked a little sad. I just wanted Picard to comfort him. Your face... They could have had an episode with Columbo on the holodeck. Yes, that would. Yeah, have worked. yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, your uh, the captain, his face looks a little down, you know, I... down on the ground. Oh, yeah, God. his face what? is kind of melting. I can't think of the guy's name. He always gets dwarf. Worf meeting Columbo would have been the most amazing. Like, forget the rest of the cast. <laughs> I love that yeah. both me and Sanguinary both went to the my wife joke. The wife. Just, yeah. I mean, Columbo has my wife. <laughs> the the two iconic lines. It's the oh and one more thing, and always bringing up his wife. Yeah, He's like the old <laughs> wife guy. He is the ultimate wife guy for sure. Because it's always like in relation to like 
trying to get the subject or the the perpetrator to talk about something and he's talking about a wife or a cousin or something you know, I, I, I sometimes talk to my wife about the cases I'm working on. She doesn't have an analytical mind, so she's not very helpful. But, you know, it helps me to kind of talk through my thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> Columbo, pump the brakes, my guy. I can't, my I wife can't is believe, a duck. <laughs> yeah, I can't believe Columbo rubber ducks his wife. <laughs> it's fucked up. <laughs> Oh, Columbo and Hellboy. I would like that would that would make even less sense, but I'd oh, still yeah. be here for it. <laughs> Alright, let me clear out the example captions and I'll get that next image. I wanna up. see Columbo take on Pinhead and win. <laughs> Columbo in well, an to previously Dolly, you can unannounced. Make that That's true. <laughs> no. Oh, why have I stopped generating art? I could have been generating art this whole time. <laughs> There was never anything <laughs> stopping you. Vigorous backspacing. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Oh, oh, you're gonna fucking sweep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that name is so good. <laughs> Baron. <laughs> I specifically picked this image out of a, a, a generator because it had two lightsaber colors. And I was like, there's a thousand. You you can't you can't throw a rock without hitting a joke there. <laughs> God, General Pepsi Colo is really good. It's super good. I'm gonna go put it on the Star Wars fan wiki. <laughs> They're not looking at it. <laughs> <sighs> oh my god. Here's your captions. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> The poll is up. I I Oh what? Master Pepsi Cola. Someone made a a a picture of uh <laughs> Columbo is a fate servant. I hate it. I really don't like it. He's really uncomfortable to be there with, like, this, like, be bikini anime lady. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I, I'm gonna lose this one, but I'm going to lose it, you know, to a good... good oh, God. This this one's a blowout. My God. Oh, oh, yeah. Like, I was pretty proud of mine, and then... Then, then it just got blown out of the water. I think by... I think every joke's funnier when you start it with in honor of Pride Month. <laughs> <laughs> like in honor of Pride Month, corporation, that's comedy. Right? right? Like if you just if you just like <laughs> filled the rest of the text with blah 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 blah, it's it's still gold. In, in honor of Pride Month, a priest, a rabbi, and a whale all walk into a bar. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, Odd. This works. I can run with this. In honor of Pride Month, a pirate walks into a bar with a wheel in his pants. 
And the bartender is like, what's with the wheel? And the pirate says, arr, it's driving me nuts. <laughs> hey, why, why is it so hard for pirates to become literate? Learning the alphabet because and all. Because it's in his pants. It's 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 his testicles. Oh, oh I get it. Uh, uh, Wobbly, is it because English is arbitrary? Oh, no. God. It's because they spend years lost at sea. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> this is where, oh, you, where, it, it's where been almost five fun. hours of this. You guys start breaking out puns. I'm going to leap across the aisle and start <laughs> Luckily, we're both on opposite sides of the country, so good luck. <sighs> Wobblecon uh, getting more and more violent. I'm ready for it. Yeah. I'm booking a flight tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we can I'm do a get few my more Mike of these. Hagar cosplay going. Okay. Yeah, I got a couple more in me. I'm not gonna go make a pizza. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I have a joke in mind for this one, but I'm not sure if... There's like several steps you have to get to the point where it's funny. You have to take a, you have to take a walk to get to funny town. <laughs> Commence the like journey. Like it's, it's a joke with an obligation. Oh my god, sanguinary. <laughs> That's solid. Oh shit, it's Neo France. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm not sure if this is actually funny, but it makes me laugh. You know what? <laughs> oh, that's really good. Oh, but I, I see what you mean by oh, it's a god. long walk, but it's so good. It's super good. Oh, Grin, no. Astronaut girls make do. <laughs> no! <laughs> Oh, curse! Can oh, you God. can you can you ban them? Can you ban <laughs> no. them for me? Just Grin just do it for mod. me. Oh. I don't. Can you unmod them and then ban them? No, Grin's too nice. She's oh. she's like offered to help me with coding problems and stuff. I can't I can't do it. Okay. I don't, I don't know the reference. Uh, um, mm. So there's a pitch. There's a picture of corn, and like the caption is "Country girls make do," <laughs> implying you put it within your. You okay, know. I was I was embar I didn't want to admit I didn't totally get the joke. It's it's <laughs> it's alluding to putting the Eiffel Tower inside your body. If okay. you know what I'm fucking saying. I get it. And, and look, there's a woman who wants to marry the Eiffel Tower, so, like, she's probably already doing right now. <laughs> Kirby and the Forg. Alright, we got our pull up. Or the, the <laughs> captions up. up. <laughs> <sighs> Bad drag cord! <laughs> <laughs> Unironically, that seems like the kind of thing they'd make. Yeah. Oh. I I forget who it was, but I was there's there's some guy who is telling a story about being gifted a bad dragon product, right? Oh, I hope and they had a box. <laughs> well, no, because it, it was it was gifted to them like because when you get something like that, you have to wrap it in a really funny way, so underneath the Christmas tree or whatever, that, or at the birthday party, like everybody knows. Uh, but they had to make a life decision about what to do with this object yeah. now that they had it. Because they're expensive, and you don't want to just, you know, throw that away. But if you hide it, that's yeah. worse. You know? So what they've ended up doing is they're using it as, like, a display on their bookshelf. Oh yeah, there you go. <laughs> because cause if you find that on a shelf in the middle of, of the room, like, it's a conversation piece. But if yeah, you find yeah. it in a box or a closet somewhere, then it's a deep, dark secret. 
I mean, I you left. I have a friend oh. who unironically bought one of those, and I met them at a convention, and they, like, whipped it out and were like, hey, did you know this thing can stick on walls? And they, like, licked the back of it and stuck it on the hotel window, and I'm like, oh, my Don't God. love that. Don't love that, actually. I ha There's a picture of me somewhere doing a thumbs up in front of a bad dragon. Logo. <laughs> when I was, like, 17. I'm not proud of that, but it exists. If it makes you feel any better, Red, I also had a friend who was staying um, at a house with another friend uh, who stuck a dildo on her door, uh, gave it a Prince Albert, and gave it a name, oh and just kind of left it up there like like a door knocker of sorts. <laughs> I don't... Just door knocker. Yeah, yeah, you know, just just for fun. Oh my God. I, I don't know if this is gonna get you it was fewer wrong. religious solicitors or more of them because you clearly need Jesus. For service, slap the dildo. <laughs> if you put a little bell on it, it'd probably jingle. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> Carmen San Diego runs out of space in her usual storage unit. <laughs> Os like, I'm turning this bus. Yeah. <laughs> turning don't it. make me turn it around. <laughs> It's another five hours back the other direction. By God, I will go back. <laughs> Can I go back through the museum? <laughs> All right, uh, let's see. You want to make this last one? All right. Yeah, let's make yeah, this the yeah. last one. I have, I have five hours. I have work tomorrow. Oh yeah. no. Oh god. Not this one again. I asked Wobbly if I could steal this picture because I thought it was gold. Cool. <laughs> 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 I refuse. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> also so good. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> All very good. Okay, I got it. I got it. I figured that. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> what? I like how he has like a mono eye and a, a mono tube. <laughs> yeah, <It's> <laughs> I hate his anatomy. And I hate like. I hate the Vons' mouth. It's everyone's favorite TV character, Ulf. <laughs> His jaw just dislocated. He's just got to put it back up there. There you go. Pulls up. You you could do worse. <laughs> oh, so much worse. Where else? I can't. I, can't. I just I can't. I'm firing myself. Oh. <sighs> I'm I'm exhausted from this, but it's all just from laughing too hard. Yeah, this was very good. <laughs> oh man. I I have not laughed this hard in I I don't remember the last time I laughed until it hurt. <laughs> oh, Jiminy. This has been very fun. Thank you all for all of this. Thank you for joining us. Uh, th thank, thank you all for, for joining me on my stream. 
This and been... hey, if any of you missed any part of the VOD, go back and watch. We did five hours of this. We had uh, five different segments. Um, it's been crazy. <laughs> Strangely, style. every segment took basically an hour. It was really it... consistent. Yeah. Neat and tidy. Just... <laughs> I... I feel like it's because a bunch of us are just genuinely kind of veteran at this at this point. <laughs> <laughs> like just just making a tight hour of content is just just a thing we can do now. <laughs> Look, you develop some skills in life. Yeah, <laughs> like shit posting. <laughs> I, shit posting I could be climbing skill. the corporate ladder, or I could be working on my tight sixty. <laughs> I thought this was I, very smart. Yeah, the, the, word for word, we almost wrote the same caption, and you hit enter first. Oh, <laughs> I was that with the backs, the the like all of the backspacing was coming from. Yeah, yeah, that was me going. Oh no 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 no! <laughs> I'm shocked that Sanguinary didn't win with the. A. I know. I really good. thought Sanguinary was gonna win that one. But. but it's a fun one, and I'm glad it took up as much space as it did. But the 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 fawns, uh, with the cool cats is extremely good. <laughs> the the you're absolutely right. This is not a frosh mixer line. Is apparently an actual Fonzie quote. But you'll be damned if you could tell which character was saying it in that <laughs> caption. <laughs> I'm surprised that I didn't uh, get either more votes or less votes for <laughs> suggesting they have an interspecies relationship. <laughs> I liked it. <laughs> I'm just happy if they're happy I, I, at the end of the day. I, yeah. I like, voted for it. Alpha is a sentient adult human being, right? Oh god, it's it's. We should stop before we start having conversations. <laughs> no, no, no. Like we that. got another hour. We got another hour. Let's talk elf. In honor of Pride Month, <laughs> let's talk elf. <laughs> <laughs> oh my Alpha god. sexual. Problematic cat eater or comedy visionary? You be the judge. Well, at least we know he eats more pussy than Batman. Hey! hey. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, everyone. <laughs> tell us who you are, where people can find you, and what you're up to. Alright. Uh, go ahead. <laughs> Um, my name is Pretty Pink Pansy, also known as Red. You know me as the guy who did uh, a bunch of offs, emotes, and promo art and whatnot. Um, I'm an artist, a shit poster, um, generally mentally unwell. You can find me at Twitter at Pretty Pink Pansy, twitch.tv slash Pretty Pink Pansy, etc. Um, look out for me in my shit posts. <laughs> They're good. I recommend. <laughs> Sanguinary? Uh, um, you can find me also on Twitter. Uh, Les Albert Wesker is eating things at uh, Sanguinary Novel. Um, and also, you can find my portfolio at Glitch Prismatic. And, uh, yeah. So I what do side is that on? Uh, here. I just put it in there. Yeah, just I just didn't know you had a top level domain. Feel free to post all of your links. Spam them in the chat. Everyone should follow everyone who's here, so. Yeah, uh, uh, freelance designer, and uh, I post some of the stuff I'm working on, and also it's just a lot of uh, garbage posts, so enjoy both. <laughs> and then uh, I'm yeah. Wobbly Python, and I like to think of Twitch as the modern day public access television, so I'm always trying to think of something new and weird to do. Uh, recently in my VODs, I've had Sanguinary on as a guest while we explored the chaotic depths of like the 2019 Pepsi brand wow. which I remember, <laughs> yeah. that sounds dull I know everybody but remember that X equals 8 Pepsi <laughs> universe and 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 everything will come into into focus the gravitation wow. of the customer towards the Pepsi brand is such similar to the light waves bending around the corona of the sun yeah, have you considered your oscillations lately? You should. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Have you gravitated towards Pepsi lately? Have you? Well, you Consider care? yourself. <laughs> also, do we want to talk a little bit about the project that you and, uh, that we all three were talking about? Do we want oh, to... sure. Yeah. Uh, I, I really need to, like, put some concrete work in on that, but I'm yeah. very down. Um, the three of us are probably going to be doing, like, a little show here and there on probably Wobbly's channel. 
um, where we talk about skills that we have and like teach the audience and each other how to do them. Like, for example, I'm going to teach the two of them how to do programming. Um, Wobbly's going to teach us a little bit about like certain parts of art theory. Uh, Sanguinary is also going to teach us about art theory and like uh, setting up your own website, that kind of thing. Um, it's all kind of like a little rough, but like we're hoping to have like maybe something later this June. So keep an eye on our socials. Mm-hmm. I, oh, I know. Teach you about boring things like contracts. I hope you're so excited. Yeah. <laughs> I am dying to teach all about perspective, and I know that, that <laughs> there's there's definitely like a bunch of. <sighs> Hang on, I'm trying to trying to center on this. It's late. Uh, the core of the idea is that. Uh, every friend that we make is a resource. Uh, they have knowledge and experience that like one another don't have. Mm -hmm. And so we're really looking for a way to bring what we can do and make it what you can do. Yeah, yeah. Just kind of like kind of like the socialist concept of like giving what we have to each other and other people giving what they have to us and just sort of like communally building up our strengths. I, and that I includes your, you, dear audience. Mm -hmm. We'll be I answering questions and whatnot. Oh yeah. Yeah. I'd 100% be lying if I did not say that my my thoughts on this were not influenced by the the Dante literature streams that Oth was doing also. And I ripped that off of Loon reading uh Les Mis. Mhm. Mm Almost like <laughs> borrowing from friends is a good idea that leads to more content. Wild. <laughs> you see how I brought that thesis around? You think well, see how I tied it all together? Well, thank you, chat, for joining us on this ride. We worked really hard on it. Whether you can believe that or not, I don't know. But uh, we worked really, really it. hard on all of this, and uh, it was a ton of fun. We've been laughing our asses off this whole time. So Hell yeah. Thank you for making it a better experience for us. And um, I don't know. Maybe, maybe if we get up the energy, maybe this will be something that we do again in the future sometime. Um, or even like an abridged version. Yeah. Look, one of us has to get on the wait list, selected from the wait list. For yeah, Dolly we need we play. need the next version. <laughs> yeah, please tweet it at the Dolly Two Devs. Uh, send them this vod. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not joking. This will make its way to YouTube as well. So. Um, uh, what raid message do we want to do? Um, oh, uh, do we have um, do we have anything like? Vaguely AI this, this generated. Pride month. I was gonna say. This oh, pride this month. Pride Month. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this Pride Month. Yeah. yeah. In, in honor of Pride Month. 